Hey everybody, this is Rob Mills from Mission Ridge Ranging Academy. I'm here today to talk about some training tips and also about uh, some of the classes that we offer. One of the biggest questions we get asked about our precision rifle courses uh, is what's the next step past the basic course? Our basic course covers a lot of data collection, uh, the basics and fundamentals of marksmanship, and effects of weather of what's happening on your bullet between you shooting from the prone or off the table to the target out to a thousand yards. Our advanced course goes just a little bit more in depth, and the big part of it being that we're gonna be shooting off of alternative shooting positions, whether that's natural terrain like you see uh, behind me, or off of a tripod, which is what we're gonna be focusing on today. A tripod is gonna allow you to build up a position in any circumstance, as long as you have the physical space around you to do so. There's a couple things to take into consideration. One is gonna be the height of the tripod, so the maximum height, if you're like me, I'm six foot two. So if I have a tripod that tops out at four feet because it's shorter, I'm not gonna be able to build a good standing position off of that tripod. The other thing is gonna be the weight. So this is a carbon fiber tripod made by Leah Photo. What carbon fiber allows you to do is to get a little bit thicker diameter legs, which are gonna help with the rigidity of the tripod, make it not wobble as much, but it's also gonna save a little bit of weight. The next thing we're gonna talk about is how to actually set up the tripod for you. So all I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull these legs out. This is a twist knob and lock. You also have lever locks, which are operate in very much the same fashion. I'll deploy all three legs before mounting the gun to it, and I'll set it on the ground. So a couple things to note. One, you can see that this tripod is not at eye level because I still wanna be able to get my body a little bit further behind the gun and actually control recoil and help create a stable position. The other thing too is just the orientation of the legs. If you look at my body, you can see that I have both legs, or I have two right legs facing to the rear in very much the same fashion as a bipod would work on a rifle. What that's gonna do is that's gonna allow whatever felt recoil we have as a result of shooting to come directly back and then directly back forward. As far as mounting goes, you have a couple of different options and a couple of different ways that you can do it, and this will be dependent on both your rifle and uh, the equipment that you have for your tripod. This is an Arca Swiss mount. This is gonna mount directly to the bottom rail on our Bergara rental rifle that has a, a Masterpiece Arms chassis. You, your other option is a clamp style, so a hog saddle and different companies like this, Bogpod, uh, who we carry periodically, uh, are gonna have clamp style where you can mount pretty much any gun to it as long as it's you know, thick enough to where that clamp will actually engage the sides of it. So this is our Bergara rental rifle. We threw it in the MPA chassis, which we carry. It does have an integral Arca rail built into the bottom side of this, this handguard or forend. What that's gonna allow me to do is mount the gun directly on the tripod, throw this throw lever, and now it's locked in there, it's very solid. From here, all I'm gonna do is build up a position in very much the same way that I would shooting off the table or off the prone. And so I'll bring my face in. Now I have a good amount of my body behind the gun to control the recoil, to maintain that stability, I also have a point of contact on the tripod itself to help isolate any movement we're gonna experience as a result of, like I said, our body making contact with it. And from here, it's just a matter of finding my target, making sure I have a good range on it, make sure, making sure I have my data dialed in, all that kind of good stuff, and engaging it. If you have a tripod uh, and you wanna learn how to shoot off of it, or you just wanna learn how to shoot in a little bit more ambiguous situations, like in natural terrain and things like that off of alternative shooting positions, our advanced class is a good uh, starting point for that. The biggest thing is you wanna have a good fundamental and baseline idea of, of how to shoot, how to build up a steady prone position, because a lot of things, like I said, are gonna transfer over onto a tripod and to a lot of these other positions. We're here to answer any questions you guys might have. Uh, if you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to me, either directly or through the store and we'll get you taken care of. We do have some advanced long range classes coming up in the next few months uh, you guys should keep an eye out for. Thanks, have a good one.